Hello everybody, you are on Andre Mihalovi channel. Today I'm gonna tell you what you can do with your old Chromebook even if it doesn't have Google Play Store. And believe me, this thing can still be useful. So, for the beginning I want to explain one simple thing. Some Chromebooks have Google Play Store. Some Chromebooks doesn't have Google Play Store. It depends on your model and on your CPU. For the example, all the version of Chromebooks have old processor that make by using 22 nanometer technology. And that's mean that those processors can support Google Play Store. You can do everything that you want, but you will not be able to install Google Play Store on this Chromebook officially. And that's why you may see some Chromebooks that have 4 GB of RAM, 4 cores, but they doesn't support Google Play Store. And at the same time, you may see Chromebook that have only 2 GB of RAM and 2 cores, and it supports Google Play Store. That's mean that this Chromebook have a newer processor and it already have 14 nanometer technology, at least 14 nanometer. So some Chromebooks have Google Play Store and some Chromebooks doesn't have Google Play Store. So if you try to do hard reset or reboot your system and after that you don't see Google Play Store, probably you will not have it. But there is still alternative ways how you can use your Chromebooks, install apps, install games and get all benefits of Chromebook without Google Play Store for sure. First of all, you can try to install apps and games from the web store. Web store is available in all Chromebooks. So you can go to the desktop, find web store and just click on it. You can install apps, you can install games, a lot of apps and program well optimized for work, for study. For the example, for video conferences, you can install Zoom. This program is available in web store. Also, there is a lot of video editing software, photo editing software. You can find software for creating 2D games on your Chromebook. So let's get it clear. You had a web store. On web store, you can install apps, games, programs, but it's still not Google Play Store. Yes, I understand. But the next solution is quite interesting. You can run console games in your browser. Yes, there is a lot of websites that give you opportunity to run games in the browser. Console games, Nintendo, Sega, PS1, PS2 and a lot of other emulator you can run in your browser. Actually, on my channel I already made video where I showing you in detail how to run console games without any problem. So, links will be here. Also, you can run Windows games. For the example, you can go to the MUOS website and it will give you possibility to run Windows game. Quite old Windows game, but Quake 3, Doom 3, Half-Life. This is quite interesting and popular game, old school game, and you can run it on old Chromebook without Google Play Store. If you have an old Chromebook without Google Play Store and you don't like it, you don't like to use it and you think that you waste your time by using this device, you can just sell it. Yes, you can sell this device. I'm a seller. Actually, when we have electricity, I'm trying to sell a laptop. You can sell anything. You can sell laptop, at the same time, you can sell unuseful for you Chromebook. So if you're tired of Chromebook and you think it useless, you can just sell it without any problem. Actually, there is two type of people who want to buy something and who want to sell something. And actually, it is lifetime tip because people will always want to buy something and always want to sell something. So actually, if you sell your old Chromebook, you can just buy a new Chromebook with Google Play Store if you want it or a laptop that runs on Windows. Definitely, it all depends on you. So actually, if I had a Chromebook and I want to sell it, I will sell it without any problem. And you know, uh, previously I had 10, 10 Chromebooks and I sell all of them. And some of Chromebooks have Google Play Store 
and some of them doesn't have Google Play Store, but people still buying them because there still is a lot of ways to use Chromebook. For the example, for YouTube, for searching, and also Chromebooks have big battery life, so people still buy Chromebooks. So let's talk about probably the last and quite dangerous solution to install other OS on your Chromebook. It is possible and when I make first video about Chromebooks, about Chrome OS, many users write me in the comment that, hey man, you can install Fido OS, you can install Windows, and actually those users already install it, but you know, they have some problems, driver issues. For the example, you have an old Chromebook without Google Play Store and you decide to install Windows even Windows 11. And then you may see that the camera not working, touchpad not working, even keyboard not working. I'm not talking about touchscreen, it probably may not work because it is not compatible and you can't find all necessary important drivers. But let's talk about benefits. I don't want to talk about it, but probably you may find some benefits. For example, if you install FIDE OS on your Chromebook, who don't know, Fido OS is the Chinese version of Chrome OS. You can install it on laptops, on computers. It is free available. I mean, you can find it on the internet without any problem, but you still need to pay $12 a year for this software. The most important that you need to know, you could install games from the Google Play Store because Google Play Store will be available in Fido OS. Fido OS looks quite similar to Chrome OS, but this is the Chinese version. Probably this is very cool, but I still could not recommend to install Fido OS or Windows on Chromebook, because in my opinion, Chromebook is well optimized for Chrome OS. And in most cases, all Chromebooks have nice battery life. Also, you can go to the YouTube, you can search for important information, but the Google Play Store is available in some model. I previously said it at the beginning of the video. If you want to install Windows or other OS on your Chromebook, on the internet you can find information how to do this. But I want to warn you, this is under your own risk. So probably after this process, your device will work not stable. So in short, in my opinion, Chromebooks are very useful even if they don't have Google Play Store. I mean, they are very cheap. If you want to install other apps, you can use Web Store. If you want to install other OS, it all depends on you and it's under your own risk. And definitely this device is still convenient and useful for many users. So guys, if this video was useful for you, please like it and definitely don't forget to subscribe to my channel, it will help me a lot. Also, on my channel you can watch a lot of interesting videos about Chromebooks, about Windows, about different operating system. And I will be glad if you watch all of them. Goodbye everyone, see you soon.